Hey, how's it going, everybody? Um, so, uh, I, I guess you saw the thumbnail. <laughs> it's kind of just, you know, like, says it all. But, um, uh, I, I had been getting asked, like, you know, when's the next Pokemon MMO 3D video and stuff. I, I get that asked, like, all the time. Um, and, uh, you know, like, like I, I have been wanting to make some, but the problem was that, like, uh, I, I guess I'll explain basically like as the thumbnail went um is that i basically left pokemon mmo 3d for a while um i'd only like hop on like every once in a while but other than that i like wasn't really playing the game and um i guess the main reason for that was that like i wasn't really having fun with the game anymore here i am i'm playing it now um the main reason why I stopped having fun with the game was, or main reasons I should say, was um, I, I would say it was more with like the community, not the entire community, just like like I guess you could say like a small handful of the community, but the community in the game is I I would say it's a bigger community, um, which means that even if I say it's like a small handful, that still means it's like a lot of people. Um, also, I think we were just kind of in like this wave. I, I don't really know if it's still going on cause I haven't been playing, but like when I stopped playing, which is around when I stopped making the videos, um, there was like this big wave of like constant people begging for Pokemon and begging to get like free legendaries and stuff. Even after having only played the game for like one or two days and they were already like begging for like level a hundred Pokemon and, and like, I, I, I get that some of them could be you know, uh, older players making a new account to like pretend to be new and get free stuff. Like, I'm sure that's, that's part of it, but like, uh, a lot of it is like newer players that like, didn't want to actually like earn their own things. They just wanted to be like, just be handed everything. And that's not really fun to watch, especially like when you actually play the game to earn your own things, to see that there are people who just want to be given everything for free. That's not really that fun to watch, uh, but it, it was worse when um, I would get like every time I would get on, I would get like tons of private messages. Um, I've, I've been I've basically been hiding. <laughs> I've been in hiding because of it. Uh, like right now, I'm like hiding underneath the stairs. <laughs> yeah, like right now, I'm like hiding underneath the stairs. Um so that people don't see me though. They kind of, I, I'm sure if someone actually look, they would find me. Um, but I would constantly get like a bunch of private messages that would always, they would always start off with, you know, uh, uh, Oh, I'm, I'm like your biggest fan or, Oh, I, I like, I like your videos. Keep up the good work. Or like, Oh, you, like I've, I just got done watching your videos. Like, uh, I really like the videos. They're really helpful or something, which, which is nice. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. It's just, like, what comes after, like, I would say there are, like, I would say that there would be, like, less than, like, 3% of the people who did message me saying that, you know, they left it at that, that was it, which, like, to those people, uh, thanks, like, thank you for that, um, it's just, like, the other 97% of the people, uh, who would say this, say the exact same thing, but, then it would be followed up with like their real reasons, which like, like their like ulterior motive, which was just to basically say, you should give me free stuff. Kind of like, like, oh, you're, you're like, like, you're like the YouTuber guy who makes the videos. Uh, you should give me free stuff was basically it. Cause to me, um, if, if you ask for it, it, to me, there's like a difference between like asking for help. And then expecting to get free stuff. If you're expecting to get things for free or you're just like expecting to get it, then like you're not asking. So really when they do say, can you give me this or can you give me that? They're really just saying you should give me this, um, which that never feels good. And I would say like what makes it worse is like they start off with like the, you know, like, oh, I like your videos and stuff kind of just like to like try and. I, I guess you could say it's like trying to butter someone up to get what you want, which that doesn't really feel good. Cause at that point, um, it kind of feels more like, uh, I'm beating, I'm being treated as like a tool instead of being treated as like a person. 
So like that kind of takes away the fun of playing the game. I can't jump for some reason. I've been I've been pressing space. I can't jump. I, I think the server might be. Oh yeah, the server's dying. All right, <laughs> I'll just keep running around then. <laughs> so really, it's kind of just like a. I'm being treated as like a a tool to get free stuff, rather than like being treated as like a person. So that already just kind of removes the fun from the game. Um. And it wasn't just, it wasn't just, uh, people asking me to give them free stuff. It was like, you know, people asking me to give them free legendaries. People asking me to give them like a free, like level a hundred Pokemon, uh, so that they could get legendaries. And these would be like people who had only been playing for like two days and like their highest level Pokemon would be like level like 10 or 12 or something or 20. And like, like I would see people do this all the time. Where, like, it would be, like, a new player who gets, like, a level 20 Pokemon, and they start asking where, like, the legendary Pokemon are, and then they go to find, like, the legendary Pokemon, and they try to fight, like, the level 70 uh, legendary Pokemon. They try to fight it with, like, their level 20 Pokemon and lose, and it's kind of like, well, like, what were you expecting was going to happen? Um, so then they lose, and then they, and then they, like, start begging people to, like, catch it for them and give it to them and stuff. Um, which like, that's, that's not cool. Like you got to earn your own stuff. And to me, it's more like, uh, you know, like, like if you don't want to play the game to like earn the stuff, if you're not going to play the game, then you shouldn't play the game. That's basically my mentality is like, yeah, it, it, that's basically it. If, if you're not going to play the game to actually like get the stuff in the game, then you shouldn't be playing the game. Because you're not playing it anyways. Now, it wasn't only just people um, asking for free stuff. It was also people, um, you know, asking me, like, like, constantly asking me to, like, take them to, like, Dragon's Den and and take them to New Bark Town and take them to, uh, like, Lake Rage and stuff, even though I'd make videos. And I'd, like, I'd, 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 like, tell people, you know, I made videos showing you how to get there. And they'd be like, yeah, but that doesn't work. Yet there's video evidence that the video itself is like video evidence that it does work. Um, literally, it shows you, you know, from start to finish me walk all the way over there. Um, it, it was just more like they they wanted somebody to take them there, not like look up a video on how to do it. And like, like I would constantly get asked that by a bunch of people. Um, but then uh, it was also I would say. I, I would say that this would probably, this was probably worse than like the people that were constantly asking me to like give them free stuff, which would be like the people who would like ask me to like soft reset Pokemon for them. They'd be like, Hey, I've been looking for Snorlax for like three days now. I haven't found it. Can you soft reset one for me? Which is uh Oh no, they found me. Ah! <laughs> they found me. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it would be like, um, uh, people that would ask me, um, to like soft reset, like Snorlax or Electrobuzz for them, or people would ask me to like soft reset starters for them, like Gen 1, Gen 2 starters and stuff like that. Um, or, or soft reset Dratini for them, where like, like they're literally basically asking me to like, uh, take like the time to go over to the area and then spend like anywhere from like a half an hour to maybe like a couple days soft resetting things like a Dratini for them. Um, and it's like, you're asking someone else to take a half an hour to a couple days worth of their time out of their own day to give you something for free. And like, like there was like a bunch of people that would ask me stuff like that. Um, and it's like, that's not, well, that's not cool. <laughs> that itself isn't cool. Oh, I do have crab hammer. I was, I was thinking so that was something else. I do have crab hammer, but, um, yeah. So like, there'd be people asking me to like, um, a soft reset, a bunch of Pokemon for them, which like, that means like they're expecting me to like take, you know, again, half an hour to like a couple days worth of my time just to give them a Pokemon for free. And it was like, it wasn't just one person. It was multiple people asking me. 
So like, let's just say like, if you take like 10 people, ask me to soft reset them with Dratini, that could take anywhere from like, what, three hours to like, you know, 20 days or something just to get like 10 Dratinis. It, it just depends on like whatever, but that means to like take time out of my day to get them something free. And that was like a lot of what that was like, like, I would say that that was like the biggest reason. Well, you know, people ask me a soft reset and people ask me to give them free stuff like constantly. Like I would constantly get like private messages from people asking me to give them free stuff and soft reset stuff for them and stuff. That's like, that's the big reason why like I, I stopped playing because I just wasn't having fun playing the game anymore. Um, you know, I, I was, I was content with just like, you know, playing the game on my own and, um, you know, just like catching my own Pokemon, training them to prepare them for like future updates and stuff like that. Um, but then it started to become less fun when I was constantly like being asked to do that. It, it basically like took the fun and the joy of playing the game out of the game for me. Um, I would also see, you know, a bunch of people like that would beg in the chat for free stuff. You know, like like free legendaries, free level 100s and stuff. And what was worse about that was, like, there were other people who would actually, like, feed into that and, like, give them the free stuff. Which, like, that doesn't feel good to, like, you know... Like, like if, if I go out and, like, I catch and I earn my own, like, legendaries and stuff and, and all the other people who've actually gone out and, like, earned their own Pokemon, earned their own, like, level 100s or earned their own legendary Pokemon... The fact that, like, somebody brand new just comes in and, like, starts begging for that for free immediately, and then that there are people out there who actually give them that, it's like, they got something that they didn't earn. Is my shadow distance small? I think it is. Nope, it's it's full. Huh. But, yeah, so, that that, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I also don't like giving away free things because, um, when, when you, I, I would say like, like when you become somebody who, you know, wants to actually earn their own things, then you can enjoy things far more than the people who just want to want a handout because you, it, it's like, like that entire journey of like working towards getting something and then finally achieving that and like actually getting that sense of achievement and i don't like giving out free stuff because i don't want to rob people of that i don't want to rob people of like that sense of achievement of actually having like earned something themselves because that like, like that means so much more and it keeps people playing the game longer uh which is the other thing is that i didn't want to like take away reasons for people to like keep playing the game or to play the game longer than they would if they just got everything free at the start of the game. But, yeah. So, that those are basically, like, the main reasons. Um, other than that, I've basically already, like, done everything in the game. I've caught, like, all the Pokemon that are currently in the game, except for Mew and Celebi. Um, those are the only two I don't have registered out of, out of the Pokemon currently in the game. Oh, I have Caps Lock on. So, yeah, basically, all the Pokemon that are red are the Pokemon that are currently in the game. And, and like, I, I have been thinking, like, other video ideas I could do while I've been, you know, off from playing the game. And, like, that would be one. Like, showing, like, all the Pokemon that were currently in the game or something. Or, you know, I thought of, like, doing shiny variations and stuff like that. But um, if you aren't enjoying or having fun uh, playing the game that you're making content for, then you shouldn't make it because you aren't having fun and like i did enjoy playing this game um and, and this doesn't mean like i'm done playing the game you know I'll, I'll just play it here and there and if i ever do decide to make another video which um another big reason why i haven't been making videos is kind of just like i wanted to make this video before i got back into making any other videos um hopefully to like i i, I would say like hopefully like make people more aware of like i don't know that the the fact that like i don't give out free pokemon and stuff i i did i did do the ev giveaway which like i was afraid of doing that in the first place because i i knew that like when i did that one free giveaway uh 
people would constantly like ask me to do more and give more free stuff and just keep giving out free stuff. The, but that the, I, I ended up going through with it just because it was the reason why I wanted to do that was because, um, you know, because making these videos, um, that got me up to like a thousand subscribers, which, uh, was like that, that was like an achievement for me. And I wouldn't have been able to do that if it wasn't for like, you know, the people watching the videos that got me there. So I really only did the EV giveaway, not for like, just to do an EV giveaway. I, I really did the giveaway just to like try and give back to basically the people who like had gotten me to like a thousand subscribers and the people who were like watching and supporting the channel. That's, that was the reason why I did the EV giveaway. I was really just doing that just to try and give back for like, you know, helping me reach an achievement or like some milestone on YouTube. Uh, so that was like the main reason why, but yeah, a lot of people, I haven't really been looking at chat either. That was another thing that happened. It was like, you know, with the people constantly begging and stuff that was just like taking away the enjoyment from the game and the people feeding into it. It was just like, why? So like, uh, it got to a point where I would just like, when I would get on, I'd just take the chat and I'd just like hide it off the screen. So I didn't have to like see it. So that way I could at least try to enjoy the game. Um, but yeah, and I, I'd constantly get like ping though for like free stuff, but yeah, that, that's basically it. Um, th th that's basically like the main reason why I stopped playing the game. I, I, I don't know. I, I've just been trying to get back in the game before I like decide if I want to do any more, uh, videos on it or not. Cause like, I liked making videos that helped people that that's what I like doing. The problem was, uh, the same people kind of like took away the reason for playing the game but i don't know well not not, not the same people it, it's a small group but um i don't know that that's mainly why i wanted to make the video just to try and explain that like no i'm not gonna give out free pokemon um i'm not gonna give out like legendaries and stuff like that i'm not gonna like soft reset uh Pokemon for you. I, I should also use this video to like <laughs> clear this up. Uh, apparently a lot of people seem to think that I'm, I work with the game. I don't, I I'm literally, and I, I say this all the time is that like, I'm just a normal player, just like everyone else. Um, is that a shiny? I don't know. That's just a normal one, but yeah, I'm a normal player just like everyone else. I just happen to make videos on it. That's literally it. <laughs> So, like, a lot of people will go, like, hey, I'm having an issue with downloading the game, this, or, oh, there's this bug that might be happening in the game or not. Can you fix it? <laughs> and stuff. And it's like, I, I don't work with the game. It's not me. Uh, it's, it's not me at all. Uh, you'd have to, like, contact this person or that person because they're the ones who are actually, like, working on the game. Um, this doesn't mean I'm done playing the game. Uh, I, I am still excited for like the new updates to get like new Pokemon, but, uh, that might take a, a long time since the game's being basically transferred from unity over to, uh, unreal. And I, and I think it's that he, I think it's, he had to like start over from scratch or something. Like, I, I don't think it's that he could transfer the, what he already had from unity to, uh, um, unreal so i think he had to probably make things i don't i don't know i don't know the whole story but yeah um so i'm just waiting for like the next update um and uh before then i might you know make other videos before then and and again uh this isn't a pokemon channel this is like a uh i heard this a couple weeks ago and i was just like ah oh, that's what that's what i've been trying to figure out how, what like what to call myself but it's not a pokemon channel it's a uh, like a variety channel so like I play a bunch of different games or do a bunch of different things. Like recently I've been like drawing and stuff like doing that. And th that's just, that's what the channel is. It's not a Pokemon channel. Uh, so don't, don't expect it to be like all Pokemon all the time. Um, there's just a bunch of games I enjoy and like playing and I play a bunch of different games. Uh, and that's basically what my channel is about. It's just me, you know, doing what I enjoy. So Yeah. Uh, that's basically it. Um, man, I, I like, I'm gonna have to edit this. <laughs> there's, there's a lot of stuff I went over and then like re went over, uh, because I didn't think I explained it well. 
and there's probably still like a lot of things I didn't explain well, but I mean, if, if it can at least give someone like an idea of like why I left and why I haven't been playing or whatever, then that's fine. I guess at least, uh, something's better than nothing, but yeah. So, all right, I guess that's it. <laughs> uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, again, thank you to all the people who had like been supporting the videos and stuff. Oh, it's a tiny one. Um, I'm not gonna be able to catch that unless I lure it all the way over, but that's fine. Um, oh, that is a, it's a baby. <laughs> it's a baby Kangaskhan. Ow. <laughs> but yeah, so thank you everyone who had been supporting the channel so far. Um, I, I hope you guys, you know, like, I don't know, enjoy the videos I, I've made so far. I hope you enjoy the videos I'll make in the future whether it's like today, tomorrow, or I hope you guys enjoy the live streams. Basically, I just hope you guys enjoy the channel as a whole. So, uh, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you all next time. It's got like a little band, or not a bandana, it's got like a little raccoon marking. Yeah. All right, see ya. <laughs>